Hey and welcome to the course RESTful Web Services with ASP.NET Core. My name is Fabian Gosebrink, I'm a full stack web developer, speaker and trainer and I will guide you through this course. The course consists of five sections. In the first section, Basics, we will explore the REST principles and get to know ASP.NET Core as well as the .NET CLI. In the second section, Exploring ASP.NET Core, we will go in more detail starting a new project, looking on what is middleware in ASP.NET Core and work with configuration and different environments in ASP.NET Core. In section 3 we will build our first endpoint with ASP.NET Core. Here we will create a data storage and talk to our API while adding, updating, deleting and manipulating data. In the fourth section we will take the next steps on our web API. We will look at formatters, validation, logging, documentation and look at security in our API. In the last section we will deploy our API to Azure and the Docker container. Before we start let's have a look at the tooling we will use in this course. The first tool we need is the console. We will use the .NET command line interface from here. As a second tool we will use Postman. We can create HTTP requests with it and fire them against our API. Most of the time we will use Visual Studio as a development environment. Here we will start at File, New Project, creating our first web API. And of course sometimes we will use a browser to see what our API provides us. Here we will use Chrome in the latest version. So for the tooling we will use the console, Postman, Chrome, Visual Studio 2017 and of course ASP.NET Core. But don't worry, we will provide all the links to the tools in the slides and in the course itself. At the end of this course, you will understand the REST style. You will also understand the concepts of ASP.NET Core. You will be able to start building web services with ASP.NET Core and modify the data using HTTP verbs. Also, you will be able to validate and log the requests and actions. And in the end, you will be able to deploy your application to Azure. Still not convinced why taking this course? Here you can level up your ASP.NET Core skills. You will understand the client and server separation and you will see the whole picture from file new project in Visual Studio 2017 until the deployment to Azure or to a Docker container. So let's get started with the first video and join me creating our first ASP.NET Core Web API. 